What's going on guys, Zenos here and today in this video of 7 Daily Sins Grand Cross, I'm going to teach you guys on how to sync data and transfer data in order to back up your data that you have been like rerolling from time to time and you might want to recover that particular account that you might have your eyes on because like you were failing in order to get those kind of SSR pulls that you were intending to. All right, and then you want to go into a compromise mode and like, okay, even if I have like that previous account, I'm pretty much all right with this one. I really don't want to go through this insane grind over and over again. Yeah, some people might quit, right? <laughs> so there should always be a backup plan. And next thing that I also really want to tell you guys is that whenever you are resetting the data, it does not only like uh, delete your global data, but even your Asian server data. All right. So that means like the whole account data will be deleted at this moment. And that can actually be a very torturous. Uh, I had a very good account on my Asian server. I did some video on the global server to do some real real guide. And when I just reset the data, what, what happened is that like even my Asian server data were lost. And that was a total devastation for me because like I had my Hauser on that account and I really do need him back. <laughs> and right now I even don't have any way to get him back. So that's why guys, data transfer and the sync data is going to be very, very essential right over here. Now I'm going to teach you guys on how to do the data transfer and sync data. Again, getting it from the very scratch, all right, just go into the menu. First of all, and go into the player info and then do the data transfer. So right over here, you will be provided some of like sync code right over here. And then you will be asked to, uh, you know, like set any sort of like password or I couldn't say like UIOUKL. Okay, right over there. It's just said like password can only consist of 6 to 14 characters. So just set your password and just click on set. All right. And what you really need to do is please guys try to save it try to save it like just uh, use a snipping tool or let's say just you know, like get a screenshot of your mobile or just write it down somewhere and because you are gonna need it uh, like somewhere near in the future whenever you want to recover this account and if you really want to sync the data to the previous one whichever the uh, account that you have pretty much your eyes set on like the previous account like I think that account is gonna be good for me or let's say in such case that like you want to create multiple accounts and just want to make a very fast switch between the multiple accounts then this is also a very good way to do it now I will try to go into my another account but before that one I really want to show you one proof okay so let's get into the heroes and you will be seeing that like this will be my heroes right up here on this account <laughs> these are the heroes all right uh, so i only have like one ssr unit and that's dn so now let's move into the next one and let's see if it actually gonna change and you also need to notice that the name of my account right over here is yuta all right just look at it on the top corner and now let's go back into the menu and we will go into the info and sync data and i will try to get my data of the another account uh let's see let's see let's see oh it's gonna take some time t Oh my god. T M Q G 6 uh, T N H. Yeah, it just says like that one. Sometimes I might like type incorrectly. <laughs> so that can be a problem. And uh, I had set my password to fast pens. Okay, that one. So if I do it and I say load, what's gonna happen is like, there you go. That's what it's gonna show you guys. All right. Confirm the information for the account you wish to load, rank to Genos 5. Now that's my account from the another one. And I will say, just say load, yeah. And it says like su successfully loaded. Like it has to like reset to the main screen. And now I can play the data of the another account. Now this is how you are supposed to effectively switch between the accounts to accounts so that like you always have a backup. You always have this guarantee plan that like, oh, Holy crap, I mean like, I think the previous account was already better. Why am I keep on rerolling? Like that kind of thing, right? And if you have that moment, then boom, just transfer your data from that previous account. And then just you are ready to like play this game uh, without any regrets at all. <laughs> Those are the things. And uh, another tip that I really want to give you guys is that like, don't fall into the trap of the ongoing uh, tier list. All right, or let's say the top recommendation, which are pretty much um, like asking you to pull the bond, uh, the uh, like 
the Gota and the King, all right? And those are the units who are still not available in this game. I have already prepared my top three uh, hero uh, picks that you will need to get from the gacha pool right over here, the draw. Uh, please try to use that one, all right? Uh, because like those are the only units that you can get for the best uh, deal right over here whenever you make these summons and now we will go into the hero section to really uh, check out if it's actually the one yeah there you go guys this is my another account and these are the heroes that I have uh, uh, like present right over here the name is Genos 5 for this account and uh, my SSR unit that I pulled is the Arthur Camelot sword all right this one this guy is pretty awesome because like he can really uh like cleanse the entire team like you know he it's too good it's really good <laughs> that's what i can say about him so this is how you are supposed to effectively switch the, from one account to another account as another thing that i also need to tell you guys is that whenever you are like successfully syncing the data what's gonna happen is that like it's actually gonna uh, ask you for to set the password again meaning like it's not gonna work every time once you use it It's used the password now. You have to set a new password or else it's gonna be in vain uh, So like fast pants. Yeah, that's gonna be it. Okay, so there we go, and I will just like set it and uh, There we go, and what's gonna happen is that like I am actually going to record it so just I'm just writing in my like, you know uh, the paper you know, like the way to record keep <laughs> or you can just use the snapshot or whatever that is in your inventory and that's all is gonna require all right just set the password and you have to make sure that the password has been set command will pop out or else it might not be like you know done or it might not be like really happening and always you can go into the sync data and then sync the uh, sync code and the password uh, that you have like saved earlier and then you can always reclaim your account so this is how it's done and this obviously is going to be a very effective tool in getting your best reroll out of all the rerolls in the game because this one will give you that guaranteed chance to go back <laughs> in the time to get that account which you had deemed to be worthless at first but later on you start to realize that like oh my god it has a really good value <laughs> it had a really good value i don't want to miss on that one at least if i get that one i'm pretty all right so in that case it's good you want to really switch from like one account to another account very super fast without changing your like uh, uh you know like google account details like let's say from one email to another email uh, right over here just do the data transfer and boom within a short period of time it's done within the same account yes multiple accounts can exist within the same account if you use this technique all right this is too good it's pretty much like resembles the same <clears throat> mechanic feature from the a One Piece Treasure Cruise. If you guys have already been playing a One Piece Treasure Cruise Global or the Japan, you guys will have no problem at all on understanding this idea. This is really great. Being able to create a lot of accounts in just one email. <laughs> really cool. I love this game. So this is pretty much it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button to keep on enjoying the contents of my channel. And guys, if you have any further opinions, reviews, or any sort of like insights or criticism, please let me know in the comment section below. Let's talk it out. Let's try to get more information from each other. I also need a lot of information which you can provide. And if I do have any information that I can share to you, obviously I will be coming back with the another video of providing you with the info useful information. All right. So this is it for today. See you guys in the next video. Indeed.